can bring up a phone call you made five years ago and play it back. The NSA? Yeah. NSA. Okay? Yeah. But that, that, that's what that's what uh, the government can do. Just think what the Heavenly Father can do. Okay? It's, it's, he sees everything. Yeah, he, he sees more than the government. And the Close government, that door, you turn all the lights off. Yep. And it's completely dark and the whole side still. You can look at it plain as day. Plain as day. Yep, yep. The scripture says the eyes of the heavenly father are 10,000 times brighter than the sun. You think you can set the sun for You know what I'm saying? A wound in this honor shall he get, and his reproach shall not be wiped away. He said, shall not be wiped away. You can think you got away with that, though. You know, Nino Brown or Kooky in the hood that's making all that dope. You know, making big money, man. Making big money. You know, making big money. You know, because there is no fucking people mind. They don't mind. Yeah, when you know when a nigga go right behind him and lick that shit out, man. That's a nigga, that's a foul nigga. That's just a foul motherfucker. Actually, yeah, wearing it. Only faggots wear condoms, too. Yeah, ain't some yep, ain't your kids, yep. Yep, yep. And wondering why he got bumps going all over his face and all his dick and shit. And sores and, and, and sores and shit. That's some that adultery, buddy. That's some adultery. That's real, man. That you ain't worried about fucking, but it's some other thing out there that's weak out that's trying to get down with you. And if you kind of throw it at him, he goes, he's over here. Oh, sorry. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's how we get your kid. In his mind, he's turning that shit down. He's trying to get it, you know? They call their ass for fucking back to them. What the fuck went nuts? You guys seen those videos of bitches looking at each other's assholes? Assholes. For hours. And you see the bitch's face be all like, get shit all growing on it. <laughs> right, yeah. It'd be some fine bitches doing that to me, man. I bet these hoes, some of these hoes. They don't bypass the pussy. They don't need to do it. I mean, how you get turned off by licking someone's ass? That don't make sense. That's the best too. I got a scripture for you faggots and you fucking freaks. Freaks and faggots. Faggots and freaks. It's a freak show. Yeah. America took the free show out of business. They had a free yeah, show yeah, back they in the 30s. The they, brought, they brought the carnival to the street. They sure they did. They brought the carnival to the street. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They sure did. They sure as hell did, bro. They Brilliant. sure the fuck did. Revelation 19 and 1. And after these things, I heard a great voice of much people in heaven saying, Hallelujah, salvation and glory and honor and power unto the Lord our God. For true and righteous is his judgment. There ain't no judgments in America. Okay, America has a, a false weight and a false balance. Oh, look at Yeah, right. The scale is, the scale is, is, is off, son. For true and righteous are his judgments, for he hath judged the great whore. That's America. The Bible calls America the great whore because it got the spirit of a whorish woman on it. And, I mean, just, just look around. You see whores everywhere. That's a bad that's bitch right there. This body better than mine. They probably not even, they just trying to piss us off. For that's true crazy. righteousness is judgments, for he hath judged a great whore, which did corrupt the earth with her fornication. Right, that democracy is being forced on the whole planet earth. And that, and that whole culture of being, uh, this whole culture of filth. That's what it is, a culture of filth. It's okay to be a faggot. It's okay to be a lesbian. It's okay for a woman to leave her husband and abandon her children and to go commit adultery, get child support from five different people. This shit is madness, man. This shit needs to be destroyed. America's going to be destroyed. God's going to destroy America. Y'all need to be destroyed. You bunch of filthy animals. A bunch of cockroaches and rats and vermin. Fucking uh, 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 steaming palace shit. <laughs> That's what it is. You know, the guy that liken America to a pile of dung. I can, I can get that script. Let me read this real quick, man. I'll oh, go ahead. Romans, uh, Romans 1 and 26. For this cause, the Most High gave them up unto vile affections. So they have vile affections in America. These are vile, filthy people. Like vile, that's where you get the word villain. It's the same thing. These people are villains. You know what I'm saying? For even their women. What they call unethical, immoral. For even their women 
did change the natural youth into that which is against nature. That's talking about you lesbians. You're going against nature. You're going against your power, your God. Keep going. And likewise also the men. And all these men, all these faggots out here. Every other man is a goddamn faggot. Walk around with a dick stuck up his ass. They need beat, they need their ass. Go ahead. Keep Leaving going. the natural use of the woman burned in their lust toward one another Men with men. So we don't want to see that filth around here. We don't want to see you coming up, bringing your filth around us, bringing your filth around our children. All right? And we pray that God kills you and destroys you. So we pray God kills all faggots and all lesbians. Working that which is unseemly. As a, to be a faggot, getting doo-doo all over your body, going inside another man's anus, getting doo-doo all over the place, spreading diseases, you spreading antibiotic resistant gonorrhea, spreading AIDS and herpes. That's foul, that, that's filth. And we have a right to be angry about it. And receiving in themselves that recompense of their error, which was me. That's hey, yeah, they spreading diseases. So we all in danger because of these faggots spreading all these diseases. And all these women too, all. Oh. And look, and now too. You see, they just got up and got the fuck out of Look, hold up. Now we got all these women. Nobody knows who their daddy is no more. So now that causes incest. So now we got a generation of incest uh, coming upon us. Because all because nobody knows who their dad is no more. So you don't know if you fucking your sister or not. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? It's a small world. It's a small world. All right, so you got all these people being born out of wedlock. No one knows who their dad is. Everybody uh, having sex with their sister don't know it. They do it knowingly too. They do it knowingly. They break right their around the corner from the kids and your kids that you got to live with you and the kids with your kids yep. that's around the corner that you never knew. That's what happens when you're living in a adulterous society. That's true. And that's going to cause all kind of genetic birth defects and all kind of shit. You know? All these diseases. No, people are dumb enough. They're retarded enough. You got little babies growing up being born in a... Uh, you got little... There's your boy. Sticky fingers or stinky... Why a genius mouth? And he used to go up in the x and rob everybody. He was banned for life. He got banned from Collector's Corner. So. Don't let him come over here. Well, he a so-called dude. He was coming around. He was looking dead at us. Like he heard us say Collector's Corner. Like, oh, shit. That nigga dirty as hell. He's been, out, he's been down here at OSU campus since 86. 85, 86. Yeah, you he's can't, been down here since. He's grimy, though. I know, I know. He looks grimy, look at him. He looks like... No telling what type of drugs he got introduced to down here. Oh, he was just hollering at them. <laughs> 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 they are in shock. Did you get his camera? I don't know. I'm getting hurt right There's no telling what they introduced to It's all stinks, sir. We ain't get it. We'll get it next time. Well, these stupid ass rock boys used to come down here and get accepted just to get accepted. They will Niggas, too. What's the fuck I'm just on my white boys, man? These motherfucking fools are willing to come down here just to get accepted and see the fraternities and sororities, man. They do any fucking thing. They take it. Actually, OSU got drugs facilities where they test drugs on you that they're trying to bring out to the market. Yeah, no oh, yeah. What they got. I've seen the ads on Craigslist. They ask you come and they pay you to take drugs. Yeah. And it's only four people that's gonna volunteer for that shit. Oh. You gotta be real desperate to volunteer. Be surprised. Go down there. That shit's packed. <laughs> and you ain't gonna packed. get no. You ain't gonna packed. get. You ain't gonna get no superpower from it. Right. It ain't gonna be like no comic book. I was, you know, you know the comic book stories. I was a testing subject, you know, you know. They tested some uh, experimental that's drugs. That's Captain America. He's a test subject. Oh no, that's how your boy Power Man got his powers. Max Payne. You remember Power Man? Yeah, Power Man. Yeah. He got a. They did the experiment on it. Luke Cage. Yeah, Luke Cage. That's Luke Cage. That's the man right there. Wasn't it the same with Max Payne? I don't know about Max. They did have some drugs in Max Payne. Here, here, I'm surprised. That's that Max Payne, that movie, too. that's a good movie. I like that. Oh, hell yeah. So was the boy. Well, they ain't real. You know, you know Nicholas Cage <laughs> named himself after him. Nicholas Cage named him. I found that out. He had a cage. So he gave himself Nicholas Cage. Who? What are you talking about? Nicholas uh, Cage. That's why he named himself named Cage. Cage. That Nicholas Cage is his full cool name. Oh, you talking about the actor Nick Cage? Oh, yeah, he named his son. Um, that's his favorite. Oh, that's, Nick uh, Cage is my homie, man. That's his favorite. Uh, what's it? <laughs> what's the movie he did? Y'all ain't seen the Kick Ass? What, what you think? You know that movie? Yeah, watch. Well, he's been the first Kick Ass. 
That's the original. That's the original. Okay, yeah. And they improved him. They improved him. Like now. It's a, that's Luke Cage, that's Power Man. He's, more, he's up more updated. Yeah. Yeah. But they used to be at one, one of my favorite comics was Power Man and Iron Fist back in the day. But that, that's what we, look, get that back on there. You was on Hornet still. I'm up, uh, we're gonna be a nation of Power Men soon. We all gonna be like that. You know what I'm saying? So, so that's the spiritual power that's in the Bible. So we joke, that's why we talk about superheroes. We use that as a metaphor. You know what I'm saying? Because soon the Lord's gonna give us power. We're gonna be busting skulls too. Yeah, yeah. Busting skulls, yeah. It like your boy is saying the bank rim, what'd he say? It's a uh, uh it's clobbering time. <laughs> it's clobbering time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we all don't know about no Ben Grimm, you know what I'm saying? These young kids today, they don't know about that shit. Yes, yeah, it's, it's gonna be shit. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. We're going to make comic books and uh, videos out the shit we do. We're going we, we to sing songs about our deeds after we do it. You know what I'm saying? You know how you got to you sing a song about the old warriors and stuff? Like, like the bard. You know what a bard is? You know how the Vikings would sing a song about a great warrior? Oh, yeah, You yeah, know yeah. what I'm saying? That's exactly how it's going to be. Well, this is Isaiah 61. A rush, shine. For thy light is come, and the glory of the Lord is risen upon thee. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth. So the darkness is about to cover the earth, all right? Because the, the destruction is coming very soon. All right? Nuclear missiles about to launch. Okay, we over here laughing, you know what I'm saying, reminiscing. But look, the missiles about to start dropping. That, that's the reality. You can't get away from it. Keep going. And gross darkness to people. But yeah, these people in gross darkness, they zombies. Like The Walking Dead. That's why you see so many zombie movies coming out. The reason there's so many zombie movies and TV shows coming out, that, that's just a metaphor. You know what I'm saying? This fiction, that reflects real life. That's just a metaphor for all these dumbass people. And soon, when these stores run out of food and there's chaos and calamity, you're gonna see the streets filled with the, all, 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 these, all these filthy people. They, they ain't gonna have no food. They ain't gonna have no food and everybody's gonna be killing each other for food. They gonna be cannibalism. That's gonna be like real zombie attacks. When people start eating you, you see people uh, taking a bite out of someone's leg or on the street. They so hungry, they ain't gonna cook it. They just gonna take a bite right into the leg and start chewing. That's, that's prophesied in the Holy Bible. That's what they think about that. That will come with the territory. That shit is getting fast. But the Lord shall arise upon thee, and his glory shall be seen upon thee. And the Gentiles shall come to thy light, and the kings to the brightness of the light of thy rising. Lift up thy eyes round about and see, all they gather themselves together. They come to see, thy sons shall come from far, and thy daughters shall be nursed at thy side. Then thou shalt see and flow together, and thy heart shall fear and be enlarged. Yeah, be yeah for the, before the kingdom come in, the destruction got to come. For one kingdom to come in effect, the other kingdom has to pass away. Yep. Like, like in the ancient world, the Babylonian Empire, okay, couldn't come into an end until the, the Persians took them out. Okay, and Alexander's empire couldn't come into effect until the Persians got taken down. You know what I'm saying? So for one kingdom to come, the other got to pass away. Just, just like the scripture says in Ezra, 2 Ezra 6 and 9, it said for, uh, uh, that's because the abundance of the sea shall be converted into the forces of the Gentiles shall come upon thee. Ahead. The multitude of camels shall cover thee, the dromedaries of Median and Ephah. All they from Sheba shall come. They shall bring gold and incense, and they shall show forth the praise of the Lord. All the flocks of the door shall be gathered together upon the yes. thee. Another thing too, like people always say, y'all anti-American. Well, first of all, I thought God created the whole earth, okay? God just ain't just create America. He created the whole planet, okay? He's the God of the entire planet, okay? And the children of God ain't got no boundaries. We're all over the planet, okay?
okay? So we don't hold no damn allegiance to no goddamn America, okay? Our allegiance is Jerusalem and the kingdom of God, okay? And we're, we're patriots of Jerusalem. That's what we are. We are patriots of Jerusalem. Because you know people always get it twisted. Keep going. The rams of Nebuiah shall minister unto thee. They shall come up with acceptance on my altar, and I will glorify the house of my glory. Who are these that fly as a cloud? And as a dove to their window. <laughs> fly as a cloud. <laughs> we said, we're going to be flying. Surely the isles shall wait for I mean, we're going to be just like the angels. We're not just like the angels. You still going to have the, the celestial beings. But, but, but the angels, they fly around in chariots. And the scripture said we got to get delivered by the chariots. That's our deliverance. That's where you get that song, Sweet Chariot. Sweet Chariot coming to carry me home. That's talking about those so-called UFOs. And the ships of Tarshish first to bring thy sons from far. Their silver and their gold with them unto the name of the Lord of the house and to the Holy One of Israel. So we're going to be stacking up like, we're going to be stacking up more gold than you ever seen. We're going to have more gold than Solomon. You know what I'm saying? That gold, that gold is very important too. That's the most, one of the most valuable resources on earth, next to food and water. Yeah, not no fake ass platinum. Yeah, not no platinum. We don't want no damn diamonds either. We want gold and silver, son. Yeah, really, gold, that's real money. The computers are made out of gold. Circuits on your computer is made out of gold. That's one of the reasons gold is so valuable. It's like in the ancient, we had computers in the ancient world. Why, they knew gold was valuable. Okay, this one of those secrets. Uh, gold is the best conductor of electricity ever. <laughs> and the sons of strangers shall build up thy walls, and their kings shall minister unto thee. Yes, yeah, so I saw it. these heathens, these the leaders of these other nations, they're gonna bow down to us. Alright? They're gonna be our servants. Just like this creepy ass cracker John Kerry. That motherfucker. I was just that horse face just popped in my brain. And I just said, this, this, he's going into slavery. He's going to serve my children. He's going to hook up, they, he going to hook up, hook up my Nintendo. Take my trash out. Go shovel some shit. And you're going to let him in the house? Uh, no, no, no. We probably not be allowed in the house. You're right. That's not a good idea. He's the market crib. Who are we going to get in the house? Who are we going to get in the work in the house? Uh, Moab and uh, Amon. Amon, Amon, Amon going to do the housework. Yeah, some nice Japanese bitches. Maybe a few. Yeah, cause, yeah, that's it. Cause you gotta Keep them away from your cat. Yeah, Moab and Ammon gonna do the housework because they're good at doing the sucky sucky too. You know what I'm saying? The massages. That, that's just their natural territory. Because when you go over to Japan, you go to China, they got prostitutes everywhere. And they give you the full service. You know what I'm saying? They'll, they'll take care. They'll wash you down. These prostitutes in America don't give you a bath. Yeah, they don't take a bath. They don't take a bath between each customer. You know what I'm saying? They don't. But then them, them hoes take that business serious over there in China and Japan, Thailand. The mama son, the mama son will take care of you. And, and then when the bitches get out of order, mama son will whoop their ass. Like, bitch, get your ass right back in the house. Over there with the Jake. Yep, a lot of mama sons is Jake, yeah, Jake because is. Jake is the going over there in the military, mm -hmm. fucking all them bitches. Because at one time, mama son was not mama son. One time she started off as a uh, you know, beginner hoe, just like the rest of them. She started off and she worked her way up. You know, after 60 years of sucking dick, she became mama son. That's the sugar walls, dick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they were always on one of those sugar walls, man. After the, blow, after the booty hole been blown out so yeah. many times. Now she's she, she in charge of the hose, man. That's she, right. No, I seen mama son whoop hoes with switches. I Ooh. seen them. She'll whoop them. Uh. The bitch get the pile, pile. Yeah, there's a documentary on Netflix, man. That's why I saw whooping the hoes with switches. I felt some switches, man. It's, a, it's like two nice documentaries on Netflix. <laughs> you can see that shit that's going on over in Pakistan, <laughs> India, the Philippines, you know. Oh, they treat they treat uh, bitches really evil over there in uh, India. They, they cruel, they, them Hindus are some cruel people, Jake, man. Uh, they some, them Jakes over there some fine they some fine, they some fine yeah. assholes. Them Jakes, man, them Jakes over there. Oh, yeah. that, see, that's why we understand the mysteries of the Bible. We understand our people are scattered amongst all these nations, right? So we know a fine ass Israelite by the bitch when we see one. We know that. I had a fine ass bitch in Pakistan. She was 
Jack. That bitch had me fucking stupid for some Jesus, man. Yep. And I was, I mean, I was fucking stupid. I was sneaking niggas all the time that was looking at me, man. Shit, I was biting them. That bitch had me doing some other shit. <laughs> I was in my youth, though. That's why I'm, I, when I was in Japan, I met this cool ass little Japanese bitch. You know what I'm saying? I never even got to see her again. But I knew she was a Jake. You know, she was cool as hell. She was talking slang. You know, this bitch knew English. She was, a, you know what I'm saying? She had swagger. She was singing, you know what I'm saying? Dancing. So, you know, Real we lively. Thought, we thought we were with other nations, but we ended up being with our own nations either. Yep. Yeah, yeah. You know, I've been with a week of Chinese bitches. They was Jake City damn money. You say, yeah. I can, I can always say the Philippines. Oh, yeah, the last of them. Right it's all yeah, Jake yeah, now. Yeah, it's all Israelites now. I don't, I don't think there's any original Filipino blood left. Yeah, every, every, Philippines, that's, every they, Philippines. But that's been in a, it's pretty much an American yeah. state yeah. now. Because yeah. the military been over there for a hundred years almost. Yeah, well, over a hundred years. Yeah. That's just every Filipino I see. They all, they yeah. It's either Mexicans over there fucking them, black people fucking in the clothes, or some Irishmen over there fucking the shit out of them hoes. So that's one but Jake over there? Yep. And then they, a lot of them, they, they bring them hoes over to America. Bring them hoes. And that's another too, is a lot of Jake's been like a talent. Yep. I was watching yep. uh, a lot of shit of documentaries. Hey, no much Jake, Thailand. Yep. Yep. yep, Thailand too. I went to Thailand, I fucked all kind of Thailand. Yeah. Yeah. I had a family here in the club. She was rich, she was rich as fuck. She was really rich. But some people try to say we don't care about our people, we don't care about him. He loves fucking, fucking the shit out of some fine ass Israelite women. That's enjoyable. And they, you know, if they, the, everything was in the right state of mind, we take them for wine. And you can't because they're all wolves. Even Mike. What's up, Elon? What's up, homie? What? What's up, Elon, homie? Elon Mike. What's up, Elon? Elamite. You don't know what the Elamite is? I know where it is, but I'm not. Where you, where you, where you from? Where you from? from Israel. You from Israel? Yeah. Israel. Oh, he's one of those so called Jews. So, which one are you? Which one are you? Judah. You're a Judah? <laughs> <laughs> Funniest thing I heard all day. Are you he a nigga? <laughs> <laughs> he said he a nigga. He, he, you don't look like one of those rats, though. You look a little different. Yeah. How can you look different? Yemeni. Yemeni? Yeah. Oh, so they, 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 you know those Ashkenazis look down on you, right? Nope. See, they look at you My, just uh, like you a goy. My ex-girlfriend was Ashkenazi, so I don't You're think a goddamn so. You know you a heathen, though, right? <laughs> Jesus is a Jew. Right. He's a, yeah. Okay, make your point. Jesus? We know that. Okay. <laughs> we know that. No, he's not a sign. Right, 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 right. That ain't a Jew. That's an Edomite. Okay. okay. You know what an Edomite is? You're an Edomite. Oh, yeah, you, you know about the story of Jacob and Esau? Yeah. Right. You, you from the line of Esau. Esau. Your spirit bears witness. Right. Your spirit bears witness. Right. Your spirit bears witness that you are the child of the devil. <laughs> I mean, I'm just the vibe I'm getting. I feel the vibe right That's the vibe I'm getting, too. That's the vibe I'm getting. You know? <laughs> His children will seek to please the poor. Yeah, you're what they call a creep cool. He's what they call a creepy ass cracker. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dang. I bet you was happy to sit on the dog, right? Yeah, that's Z-Man. He was excited, weren't you? He got a Z-Man t-shirt. Who <laughs> <laughs> so said it's with? We with the truth. With the most high. With the most high. Okay. You know, the name, we can't give you the name of the actual draft that you win with. You know, we just can't just blurt his name out just to anybody. Who? The Lord's name. The Lord and his father's name. I know. Not Jesus. Jesus! You, you, you love Jesus? Yeah, I do. Look, oh, you study the Bible? Yeah, I do. So who did Jesus come to... Uh, he talks to saints like that. He talks, who did he Jesus come to save, though? They you know? say it, all of them. All who? <laughs> all of what is, who is us? Who is us? Define us. The followers. Because us? Because you have us and them, right? You have us and them. Who is us? Specify. People. Be specific. People. 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 No, be specific. People. You gotta be specific. Come on, man. Where's that battery? We're giving you a break here. Oh, yeah, this is be specific. The people who believe in it. Well, be careful flying that one in because yeah. it's messed up. Well, I gotta stop. Right, go ahead.